Hello and welcome to Isabel's Kitchen. Today I'm showing you how to make sherbet cones. First of all we're going to make the sherbet. Now you need one teaspoon of baking powder. Put it into the bowl. You also need one teaspoon of citric acid. And one teaspoon of any type of jelly crystals. You just need any type. I'm going for orange. And then you need 20 teaspoons of icing sugar. And you put that into the bowl. And then you stir really well so it's all combined through. And then just keep stirring. See how it's all stirred through. And that is your sherbet. Now we're going on to the second stage of sherbet cones. First of all, we need 21 grams of gelatin. Then we need 125 mils of water. And then we just like just gently whisk. And there we have it. And then next, and next we have to let this set. And then we will go onto the soft boil top. This is step three of the sherbet cones. You put 400 grams of sugar in the pot and then you put half, half a cup of glucose and then you put 125 grams of water in and then you cook the syrup for approximately 8-10 minutes till it is soft boiled. Step 4 is to put the sherbet into the cone. You put one and a half or two teaspoons, as many as you would like. I'm putting two in. Just to just do the bottoms. Okay, and if you still have sherbet left over, you just keep doing those. Okay, now we're going to put the gelatin in. See how it's nice and set. You put it into the bowl. And then the syrup is going to go in with it. Putting the syrup in with the gelatin. Just be really careful because it's really hot. Okay, so see it's just okay. Now I'm going to mix it up. Just see all the gelatin's melting in. Now I'm going to put the, you can put two teaspoons of um, vanilla flavouring. Okay. Now we have to blend it up. So I'm just going to blend it up nicely. <laughs> This is ready and you can see that it's nice and thick now. We're just about to pour it into the cone. Okay, so we'll just do that. Okay, so now we're pouring it in. I've already poured some. And just fill them up. Fill them up really well. This is a very messy job. So if it's too thick you can just put it in the microwave so it can just thicken down a bit and you let this rest for a little while. <laughs> you let this rest for a little while 
and then you put hundreds and thousands on them. Just maybe set, let them sit for about five, ten minutes. <laughs> and then you can, then you put the hundreds and thousands on. So, I'm doing the last one. There we go. And then you just put hundreds and thousands on. <laughs> you just do a little sprinkle. Just like that. And there we have it. Your sherbet, your sherbet marshmallow thing. So just put it for five, ten minutes and then there you go, eat them up. Please enjoy. Bye.